about. We've got a goat. It's had twins. Uh, he's still down pushing, so there might be a third. So let's go and have a look. What's happening there? This one's been there. She was trying to deliver it. And its head were twisted back. This so is struggling a little bit, yeah. It is struggling. We've got it's breathing. It's got a good heartbeat, it's breathing quite well now actually. But it's a little uh, a little bit delicate. What's happening there, Dave? Just trying to stimulate it to breathe, really. Just blowing on it, you know, a little bit of hair on its nose. I think it's going all right now. Yeah, and that's a lot better. It's a little boy, isn't it? All right, well done, Mum. So another one day, that's they're big, aren't they, for quads? Yeah. This one were born in the sack. It's a good job I was here because yeah, they're just breathing all this mucus. Well done. Mum doesn't seem too fussed, does she? Yeah, they're quite mild goats, aren't they? I'll just step back and let them have a, let them have a lick. <laughs> the third one is a little bit delicate. I think we might have to rig a lamp up on that one. But uh, the rest of them uh, are doing really well. So. so will they need some extra TLC being quads, do you think? Or? Definitely. I think she'll have enough milk because these are quite a milky goat, so yeah, I think that's a, that's a good result. Right, I'm just going to move these goats across into a pen so she can get that bond and the, the, the little goats could start wandering off in all directions and she won't be able to cope with it. So I'll, I'll move the two strongest first. That's them two. I'll tell you what, there's some weight about them, Dale. It's absolutely vital that these quads get some milk immediately. We can't leave them any length of time without feeding them because they're up against it already, they're only tiny. We've got to get some colostrum, the first milk, straight down into the tummy so it can be working its magic. So even though she's got quite a bit of milk, she, they might not necessarily be able to get it as quick as they need, is that? Yeah, they, I would say, through bitter experience, these goats have got no chance unless we feed them to start with and give them the strength to find the teat and to, and to get the milk and get the nutrition that they need. So this is giving them a fighting chance. Once we've got these, uh, these quads fed, these boar quads, we're going to take them up to the roundhouse, we're going to put them under a lamp and we're going to give them intensive care. For these to survive, we're going to have to work really hard and make sure they're fed at regular intervals and teach them to drink off mum eventually. 